Imagine waking up in the morning and seeing you've earned money while you were dreaming. Sounds too good to be true. Well, it's not just a dream. Passive income is all about making your money work for you instead of the other way around. In this series, we're going to explore nine amazing ways you can start earning passive income. From renting out a property to snapping photos that sell, we've got a lot in store. Ever thought about writing a book in your pajamas or earning money from a beach in Bali? We'll show you how. But here's the deal. It's not a get-rich-quick scheme. It's about smart choices and a bit of elbow grease. So buckle up. Whether you're a budding entrepreneur, a stay-at-home parent, or just someone looking to add a little extra to your savings, these chapters are your roadmap to financial freedom. Let's get started and unlock the secrets to earning money while you sleep, one chapter at a time. Chapter 1. Unlocking the potential of rental income. Let's talk about making money through rental properties. You know, it's fascinating that as of 2021, around 36% of US households were renting, showing just how big this market is. So how do you get started? First, it's about finding the right property. Whether it's a cozy apartment, a bustling commercial space, or even a holiday home, location is key. Think about it. A property near a university or a tourist spot is like a gold mine. Now, being a landlord isn't just about collecting rent. It involves maintenance, understanding tenant laws, and sometimes dealing with late-night plumbing emergencies. But here's a cool fact. Platforms like Airbnb have made vacation rentals super accessible. Did you know that in 2019, Airbnb hosts earned over $6 billion worldwide? That's huge! Chapter 2. The World of Peer-to-Peer -peer Lending Let's switch gears to peer-to-peer -peer lending. It's like being a bank but cooler. You lend money online to people or small businesses in need, and they pay you back with interest. It's that simple. Platforms like Lending Club or Prosper make this super easy. But remember, with great power comes great responsibility. You've got to be smart about who you lend to. Diversifying your loans can help spread the risk. Here's something interesting. Reports suggest that the global peer-to-peer -peer lending market could reach $558.91 billion by 2027. That's a lot of dough. But remember, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. There's a risk of default, so don't put all your eggs in one basket. Chapter 3. Making money with automated dropshipping. Now on to automated dropshipping. Imagine selling cool products without the hassle of stocking them. That's dropshipping for you. You set up an online store, someone orders a product, and your supplier ships it directly to them. You never even see the product. The key here is choosing the right products and suppliers. And guess what? In 2020, the global dropshipping market size was valued at 149.4 billion. Mind-blowing, right? Here's a tip. Focus on customer service and marketing. A happy customer can be your biggest advocate. And with social media, you can reach millions without breaking the bank. Remember, it's not just about selling. It's about creating a brand people trust. Chapter 4. Dividends, the gift that keeps on giving. All right, let's talk about dividend stocks. Think of them like a thank you note from companies you invest in. By owning their stocks, you get a piece of their profit pie. Now, not all stocks pay dividends, so you've got to pick wisely. Companies that have a history of paying dividends are like the steady eddies of the investment world. Here's a cool fact. Did you know that, historically, dividends have contributed to over 40% of the total returns of the S&P 500? That's pretty impressive. The key is to reinvest those dividends. It's like a snowball rolling down a hill, getting bigger and bigger. And don't forget, it's not about getting rich quick. It's about building wealth steadily. Patience is your best friend here. Chapter 5. High Yield Savings and CDs. Your money's safe haven. Now, on to high yield savings accounts and CDs, certificates of deposit. These are the unsung heroes of the financial world. They're like a cozy blanket for your money, keeping it safe and warm. With high-yield savings accounts, you get higher interest than regular savings accounts. And the best part? They're pretty low risk. CDs are like a time capsule for your cash. You lock your money away for a set time, and in return, you get a fixed interest rate. It's like telling your money, see you in a few years and you better grow. But remember, the longer you commit generally, the higher the interest. According to the FDIC, as of 2021, the average one-year CD rate was around 0.14%. Not a get-rich-quick scheme, but it's steady. Chapter 6. Share your knowledge, creating an online course. Let's shift gears to something really exciting, creating online courses. 
This is where you can turn your passion or expertise into profit. Whether you're a whiz at baking, coding or gardening, there's an audience out there. The first step, identify your unique skill. Then break it down into digestible lessons. Did you know that the e-learning market is expected to hit $375 billion by 2026? That's a lot of potential students. The beauty of online courses is the create once sell many model. You put in the effort once and reap the benefits over and over. And with platforms like Udemy or Teachable, getting started is easier than ever. Just remember, the key is to provide real value. Your course should solve a problem or fulfill a need. Chapter 7. The ebook revolution. Your words, your income. Ever thought about writing an ebook? It's like planting a tree. You nurture it once and it bears fruits for years. Here's the thing. Ebooks are a big deal. In 2021, ebook sales reached around 1.3 billion in the US alone. So how do you start? First, pick a topic you're passionate about. It could be anything from cooking to coding. Writing an ebook isn't just about words. It's about connecting with your readers. Keep your writing simple and relatable. Remember, people love stories, tips, and practical advice. Once written, platforms like Amazon Kindle make it super easy to publish. And the best part? You earn royalties for every sale. It's like getting paid for your thoughts. Chapter 8. Affiliate Marketing. Earning while you sleep. Let's dive into affiliate marketing. It's like being a salesperson but online and without the suit. You recommend products or services and earn a commission for every sale made through your link. Sounds easy, right? Well, it's simple but not easy. First, choose products that you truly believe in. Authenticity is key. Here's an interesting bit. By 2022, affiliate marketing spending was expected to reach $8.2 billion in the US. That's a lot of opportunity. Start by promoting products on your blog, social media, or website. The trick is to provide value to your audience, not just sell. Share your personal experiences with the products. Remember, trust is your currency here. Chapter 9. Capturing the World. Earning with Stock Photography. Finally, let's talk about stock photography. If you love photography, this could be your goldmine. Stock photos are everywhere, websites, ads, blogs. And the demand? Always growing. The key is to take high-quality, unique photos. Think about what businesses and designers might need. Did you know that Shutterstock alone has paid out over $1 billion to its contributors? That's huge. To start, understand what makes a good stock photo. Think about composition, lighting, and subject matter. Then, upload your photos to platforms like Shutterstock or Adobe Stock. Each time someone downloads your photo, you earn money. It's like your camera turning your clicks into cash.